Sim Darby Engineering. Oil and Natural Gas Corporation Limited ONGC Process Platform for B193 Project. The field is located in the Hiripana Basin block of Bombay offshore basin between 60 to 90 km of Mumbai. Awarded to the consortium of SDE Malaysia and Swiba Singapore. The SDE scope of work is to survey, design, engineering, procurement, fabrication, loadout, transportation, installation, hookup, testing and commissioning. The SDE scope is inclusive of marine spread, subcontractors, gas sweetening unit, quality assurance, safety studies, fabrication yards, taxes and UTs. Our team has mobilized to detail design engineering consultant on uh, July 2010 and to produce uh, detail engineering durable which is uh, fabrication friendly. This is to help our project team to expedite their construction and their exploration work at site. Uh, we use uh, PD uh, software like uh, we call it PDMS. This is a plan uh, design and management system. Um, as part of uh, us build, we are preparing a 3D intelligent model which uh, will be shown all the components and to be published all the essential documents like uh, data sheets, uh, NID, uh, vendor data, etc. etc. Full load out, uh, we use the skidding system using the stranjak uh, method and we have four stranjak used for every top side. For installation of shore, uh, we use the plot roller method, we use the submersible barge combined with the uh, hydraulic traffic system and this is the first plot roller method done in Indian waters. Thank you. I am as the coordinator for Panadol. So, Panadol Computation is the one of the important uh, department which is we are covered and we are compiled all the documentation which is come from the various departments such as is from QQC, material, engineering, as well as from commercial. So, while everything is done, so we need to hand over to our ONGC as the final, the final stage. We So in order not to have the impact, negative impact to the fabrication and the uh, commissioning, the ton installation cut machine offshore, uh, Sinabi Engineering procurement team have uh, identified several 
uh, for several we call it uh, strategy uh, to ensure that the material are delivered to the yard uh, on time uh, and the correct time. The, such as that we have uh, identified the expediting team uh, that will act ag aggressively to bring the material earlier to the yard with procurement activities. We also have paid advance money to the uh, vendor, to the supplier I mean, or manufacturers so that they have some funds to immediately purchase the raw material. This is a very challenging uh, project in, during my service with Sangabi for 22 years and currently we are completing the job and currently this project producing the intended production that we want. Hoping for the best for the project. Thank you. Our B193 process platform project for our clients ONGC is by far the most challenging project undertaken by SDE and our partners. There were so many challenges that we were facing. One of the most serious ones is that the location of the fabrication was done at one place, the location of the site is at another place, and the clients is located at another location. So the challenges that we were facing to coordinate all the activities in this project was very, very extreme. But fortunately, with the assistance of all involved, including the clients and our partners, we managed to deliver a world-class project for our clients ONGC. And with that, we are very thankful with the opportunity that we had to undergo such an experience. Thank you. This uh, B193 process platform uh, is the single largest uh, EPCIC project that uh, SDE uh, has done. Uh, it's constitute, uh, it's the, the weight of the total top site, total uh, project is in the region of almost 40,000 ton, met, uh, 40,000 metric ton. Um, this is a single achievement, single largest achievement as far as SD is concerned since the days of when we started the fabrication yard way back in 1980s. Um, and uh, as much as it is a challenge to SDE, but we are very much up to the challenge. Uh, we have done a lot of projects in the past that will ensure that we have the necessary expertise, necessary resources, necessary yard capacity to undertake this work uh, for NGC. And I guess to a certain extent, uh, that confidence trans uh, resulted in uh, ONGC having the confidence in SDE and the consortium with uh, uh, Swiber to undertake this job. Um, when we first started way back in, uh, when we first awarded this contract way back in uh, May of 2010, uh, 
Syme Darby Engineering was going through a certain phase in their uh, yard development and also in the evolution of the company. To a certain extent, they have just gone through a very bad experience for some of the overseas job. Uh, however, having said that, I think the uh, experience that we had in previous job um, uh, it is going to be used by SDE uh, to the extent that we will ensure that the performance of the B183 project will not be compromised. And uh, unfortunately, and due to, to the restructuring of the Syme Darby uh, group, we, the, the business of the oil and gas has, uh, we have decided to more or less divest during the course of doing this work. Just imagine having to undertake a, a 40,000 metric ton job uh, at a time when uh, Syme Darby is going through uh, the whole restructuring process. Having said that, I think this is the true marks of the uh, uh, SDE team and also the, the, uh, the consortium with Swiber, whereby uh, during our transformation, during our divestment uh, uh, exercise, we are still committed and we have shown uh, uh, our commitment in completing the job uh, to the full satisfaction of ONGC. There may be some issues like any other projects. There may be some issues uh, with regards to engineering, fabrication, the installation, vendors and so on and so forth. But nothing that will, uh, it's not out of the ordinary and it's nothing that will uh, make this project being abandoned halfway. That is never uh, been contemplated by SDE. We are very committed to finish the work and true enough, we are here today uh, to celebrate an occasion whereby with the successful handover of the B183 process platform to NGC marks a significant milestone in many ways. Uh, for one, I think this is the first uh, top site that was installed through a floatover concept. SDE has done a lot of float over concepts before in our previous job, be it in Malaysia as well as uh, other parts of the world. And this is nothing serious, uh, nothing new to us, but uh, probably as far as uh, ONGC is concerned, this is uh, uh, a new breakthrough. We are glad and we are happy to be part of the new breakthrough by uh, ONGC. <coughs> Uh, of course, uh, like I said earlier on, we face a lot of challenges in this project and um, uh, with our sheer uh, dedication, sheer uh, hard work and the commitment of all the staff uh, that we have, I think we have today uh, completed this assignment to the satisfaction of ONGC and I dare say that I think the quality of the work that's been uh, 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 provided by the team is of a high standard and I think uh, ONGC will concur with us even though the uh, completion is slightly uh, past the original completion date but at the end of the day you, you, they, they are getting a, a process platform that is of the highest uh, quality ever. On that note uh, Thank you very much uh, for giving us the opportunity to be a part of your uh, service provider, part of your contractor uh, that is creating the new breakthrough to you in terms of the uh, first uh, float over analysis. And uh, we wish ONGC well in their future endeavors. Thank you very much. Finally, the B193 process platform is completed with the excellent expectation from the client. Highest skill engineering expertise. SDE with the intensive hard work and professionalism. Significant milestone of historic triumph in India. Oil and Natural Gas Corporation Limited ONGC Process Platform for B193 Project. Syme Darby Engineering.